Welcome to Southport Marina's boat rental safety video. Featuring Southport Stingray 231 dual console. Safety equipment location. The majority of the safety equipment is located under the front two seats of the boat. Safety equipment includes an emergency throwing device, enough life jackets for everybody on board, an emergency flare kit, a first aid kit, an air horn, and a fire extinguisher. Boat storage areas. You are welcome to use the storage areas underneath the rear seats of the boat and also the compartment under the floor of the boat. Underneath the middle rear seat is actually a cooler that can be used to put ice and drinks. Under the helm of the boat, you'll find a cooler that you're welcome to use as well as the registration card. Bathroom and waste bin. Each boat comes with a fully functioning head with flushing capabilities. Inside the bathroom you'll also find a sink and a couple of cup holders. The waste bin is located underneath the sink behind the driver's seat of the boat. General operation of the boat. First you'll need to turn the battery switch to the on position which is just to the right. After this, you'll want to click the down button on the shifter to lower the engine completely into the water. Next, you'll insert the safety tether, take the key and insert it into the ignition, and turn the ignition to start. Display interface and controls. The main screen that will show up when you turn the boat on will give you your GPS speed, your direction, your GPS position, and your depth. The smaller screen to the right will give you your fuel used, the amount of fuel you have left in the boat, the engine temperature, and your RPMs. Below that you'll have a VHF radio for safety reasons. Next you have your stereo button and the stereo also has Bluetooth capabilities. Beside that is your horn. The buttons to the right include your trim tabs, fresh water, bilge, dock lights, and anchor lights. To use the fresh water, click the fresh water button, then you can turn on either of the sinks on the boat. tow bar and anchor. The tow bar is located in the back of the boat. By pulling out the tab it releases the bar and you pull it all the way out until it clicks into position. The anchor is located in the front of the boat. When you use the anchor make sure to throw at least twice the line as depth you're in and tie the anchor off to a cleat on the boat. State numbering, bumpers, and dock lines. The state numbering is located on the port and starboard side of the boat. The bumpers are also located on the side that you'll be docked on. Make sure to move those over if you're docking on the other side. Lastly, dock lines will also need to be positioned on the side that you'll be docking the boat. You'll need at least one in the front and one in the rear. I always suggest taking the rear line off while the boat is in motion. Thank you for watching and feel free to ask any other questions you may have. 